Nutrition Explained The human body has been genetically engineered to store fat over the years as a fallback mechanism in the absence of available food. The average everyday diet is largely a combination of 1. Carbohydrates in the form of rice, potatoes, white bread and alcohol. 2. Proteins in the form of meat and eggs. 3. Fat, fat from meat, oil and butter. 4. Vitamins, plenty of fruits and vegetables. Such a diet would contain 84 grams of carbohydrates, 75 grams of protein and 53 grams of fat, generating about 5200 kilojoules of energy. From this meal, the body uses 50% of the carbohydrates available, 33% of the protein, 25% of the fat and 100% of the vitamins with the rest being stored as adipose tissue, predominantly around the abdomen. Excessive eating over and above these levels only results in more adipose tissue accumulating in the body. Let's look at some of the popular dietary measures to control fat in the body. 1. A 1200-calorie diet the insufficient supplies of energy to run the vital systems of the body results in weakness, tiredness, bone loss and muscle wasting. 2. Low-carb diet As carbs are the main source of fuel for the body and are vital for retaining water and for the immune system to function effectively, such a diet results in weakness, tiredness and diminished immunity. Third, missing meals and meal replacements. Such a diet results in a slowing of the body's metabolism, while the increased hunger levels might result in binge eating and larger meals. This results in tiredness, irritability and the inability to concentrate. What about the other fad diets currently being advocated in the market? Instead of adopting extreme measures to reduce fat deposition in the body, controlling the levels of fat with smart eating and a balanced diet is the way to go. A balanced diet would contain one item from each of the following. 1. Carbohydrates, either whole grain bread or brown rice. 2. Proteins, either lean meat, egg whites or soya beans. 3. Fat, sunflower oil, olive oil or vinegar oil. And 4. Vitamins, plenty of fruit and vegetables. Such a diet would contain about 41 grams of carbohydrates, 52 grams of protein, protein and 16 grams of generating about 2600 kilojoules of energy. On digestion, all the carbohydrates Proteins, fat and vitamins are completely utilized, resulting in no excess fat deposition. This results in better weight control, energy, exercise capacity, bone and muscle health and reduced risk of chronic disease.